Hi again. Got a little quick one here. Um, observation about uh, equipment and and or the quality of the stock content. Not to beat up on Autodesk, it's a hard job. Um, but here's some stock components. Here's a stock single duct VAV. These are stock air terminals. I've created a, a system, supply system for this network here. And this VAV is here. If I use the uh, analyze feature and use check duct systems, I get an error message. It says at least one connector is not assigned or is assigned a default supplier. That's the uh, air handler RTU side. But if I go to the next error message, I get one that says it's not possible to calculate the flow since all the components in the system have the flow configuration set to preset or system. At least one component is required to have the flow configuration set to calculated. That's because these connectors are set to preset. The assumption being that you're going to dial in what their values are manually and you're going to let the total accrue to the VAV box. Now interestingly enough, if I look at the properties of the family or look at the construction of the family, when I select these connectors, there's a link between this connector and that connector. And if I look at this connector, this is the supply air side, the inside, notice it's set to preset. And that makes sense because I'm going to set this so that it pushes a value up to the air handler. This side, on the other hand, is set correctly. It says calculated. It's supposed to calculate the preset values of the air terminals. No problem. The problem is this link. If I remove the link and then load this thing back into the project and try that again, I get one warning, just the warning about the supply side not being assigned. No worries about the flow anymore. So if I go in, try to do sizing, uh, take a look at the system browser here, it's pushing the values properly up into the VAV and I don't get that duct warning er error anymore. So it seems to me that this family should have been built without that link created between the two connectors. And my understanding is that the link really only needs to be used when you're trying to direct more than one set of connectors, like in, a, in an X crossing pattern where you need to be able to define um, that a connector on the left hand side is supposed to connect to one on the right hand side while the opposite is true for another pair. Anyway, if you find that you run into problems with stock content, it's worth going in. You can't make the raw assumption that they're going to work because they are stock. They're built with assumptions incorrectly or correctly. It might have been built correctly for a different reason, but in this application it generates an unnecessary error and prevents you from actually doing what you want to do with the system. Hope it helps.